Lockport, I'm Jessica. And I'm Mackenzie. And, and it, it is time, time for your LTHS Weekend Review. The Gay Strand Alliance will meet this Thursday at the school in the Maroon Room at East Campus. Everyone is welcome. Be true to yourself, everyone. Be yourself. Mm -hmm. The Porter Players are proud to present this year's fall play, Radium Girls. You can come see Radium Girls this Thursday, Friday, and Saturday evening at 7 p.m. and Sunday at 2 p.m. in the East Campus Auditorium. Radium Girls is free with a student ID. And Grace and Allie had a chance to get a sneak peek this week and spoke with some of the players. Let's check in with them. Hi guys, I'm here today with Liam and he is one of the stars of the show Radium. So Radium Girls is about a, a uh, group of girls in um, Orange, New Jersey and so they worked at this plant where they manufacture watches that glow in the dark with radium. And radium is a very radioactive element and they didn't know that it was toxic back then. But this kind of talks about when they found that out and the girls started to get sick and they fought to get compensation from the company and there's a lot of moral struggle between the company and the girls and the leaders of the company. So yeah, it's a, a very good story about the struggles that they faced and what ended up actually happening for them. It's based on true events in the 1920s. Oh my God. Yeah. That's, cr that's crazy. Uh, my character is Diane Reeder, who's the wife of Mr. Reeder, and she finds herself in a strange situation because she wants to support her husband to believe that he's a good man, but she, she hears all these ho horror stories about how all these girls are dying because of his company and what he's done. So she's in a very conflicted place. So what are your opinions about the play? Do you like it so far? Have you seen it all the way through? Uh, yes, we've uh, seen it all the way through on a couple of rehearsals, and I think it's very great. Um, it tells a story that like I never knew existed, and I don't think the common person would know existed. So um, I think it's great to like inform, but also entertain a little bit. Yeah, that's crazy. I had no clue it was like a true story until mm -hmm. a couple minutes ago. That's how long has it been for you know setting up props and you know getting everything together? It, meaning building it and all. We started I think late August, early September, and then we have primarily been working on it constantly, actually. There's small details here and there we're still working on, but it's basically everything that's major is done. It's just small touches here and there. Magazine and Creative Writing Club of LTHS meets every Tuesday at the school in room 229 at East. All are welcome to attend. Next week, the College and Career Center will have visitors from Joliet Junior College, Western Michigan University, and St. Mary's University of Minnesota. Sign up with Mrs. Crosby in the College Career Center if you are interested. A bunch of interesting colleges Yeah. Are fun. And congratulations to the girls cross country team for qualifying for state on Saturday. Freshman Hannah Miller, Kayla Sheen, Monica Shibiki, Caroline Turner, Junior Josephine Bobber, and seniors Abby Kozak and Madison Polinski ran a great race. Congratulations. And also, congratulations to boys cross country runner Ross Cronholm on qualifying. Way to go, everyone, and good luck in period this weekend. Hey, Jessica, do you want me to go do the weather, weather? Right now? Yes, please. Oh, okay. I appreciate yeah. it. I'll Thank go. you. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. Okay, bye. Bye. Hey Porters, I'm Mackenzie, here with your LTHS forecast for the week. Light snow and flurries are possible in the morning on Thursday. Mostly cloudy in the day, and then the clouds will diminish. Partly cloudy overnight with winds diminishing, and the cold nighttime low near 20. Friday will be mostly sunny and unseasonably cold with a high in the low 30s, 20 degrees below normal. Partly cloudy overnight with steady nighttime temperatures with a low in the mid 20s. Morning sun on Saturday, then increasing afternoon clouds, milder with a high in the upper 40s, but winds will turn west overnight. A light chance of snow are, as clouds increase, but the low will be in the 30s. Sunday will be mostly cloudy with early snow showers, and then becoming partly cloudy with flurries possible. It's going to be windy and colder with a high in the low 30s. It's going to be partly cloudy and cold overnight with a low near 20. Veterans Day will bring partly cloudy, breezy, and unseasonably cold temperatures. Some flurries are possible, though, and the chance of lake effect snow showers in the sections of the Lake Indiana, Indiana Lake Snow Belt. 
a high in the upper 20s and the low in the upper teens. And that's it for your LTHS forecast for the week. I'm going to head back to the studio now. So, <laughs> Hey, Porters. Have you gotten an email from the East Media Center lately? No, I haven't. What's it for, Jessica? Well, you may have an overdue book. Oh, I don't have one of those. <laughs> but here's the good news. Amnesty Week is here. You can return any overdue book, and your fines will be totally wiped out. Please note, this does not apply to Chromebooks. So check your email, look for that book, and bring it in to get rid of all your fines. Hey, Jessica, do you need help with your homework? No, but do you, Mackenzie? No. But hey, Porters, if you need help with your homework, the kitchen table is located in room 93 in the K hallway at East Campus and has tutors Monday through Thursday. Snacks will be served. Sounds delicious. It does. And students, if you are waiting on a Chromebook repair, please check your LTHS student email. The technology department sends email notifications when your Chromebook is repaired. Hey, are you interested in a weekly news show about LTHS? Helping with the information on the monitors in the cafeteria or streaming live broadcasts of LTHS events? Then come join the video club. Please meet in the East MIS after school on Tuesdays at 310. Join us. Join us. Become, become one, one of us. us. And that is it for your LTHS Weekend Review. I'm Jessica. And I'm Mackenzie. Thanks, Thanks for watching and go Porter!